Slide the coupler bar into the base section of the crane. Slide the first cable support over the aligned frame. Use an inch and a half long threaded knob to secure it. Place the female threaded knob on the inside of the frame. Leave the knobs loosened. Repeat the process on the opposite side of the frame. Slide the coupler bar into the control rod and tighten the knob. Leaving the supports in a loosened state, slide the midsection onto the base section using the crossbar as a grip. Use the half inch threaded knobs to fasten and leave loosened. Place the crane onto its side and attach the control rods together. After inserting the coupler bars into the final segment, leaving the half inch knobs slightly loosened, slide it into the midsection, making sure it's tight before securing the knobs. Place the crane onto its side again and connect the last two control rods. To attach the support cables, begin by inserting an eye bolt into the base section opposite of the handle. Starting with the looped end of the cable, place the first threaded eye bolt into the base section. Thread the cable over the first support. Place the next two eye bolts into the threaded hole of the tip section. Thread the cable over the last support and hook into the rear eye bolt. Tighten the turnbuckle to remove slack. Mount the crane on your chosen support system. Secure the camera to the mounting platform. Attach the weight bar to the base of the crane. Mount the counterbalance weights to achieve a perfect balance. If needed, you can fine-tune the balance by adjusting the locking shaft collars to move the weight's location on the bar.